Hi, today I'm going to prepare an interesting little uh, pickle mix and it's from Icebox Hot Pickles and it's for herbs for, un for healthy living. And I found this at my local um, farmer's market. Um, I, this was at Simmons and it also has on the back some directions. So I'm going to modify these directions a little bit. Uh, so it says to do your cucumbers uh, in a jar or gallon container and it says to use the whole packet. It also says to use uh, distilled white vinegar and sugar. Well, I'm not going to use sugar in this recipe, but you'll see what I've added. Uh, and then you're supposed to pour it over the cucumbers um, and then refrigerate for 24 hours. And it says it'll keep for six to eight weeks in the refrigerator. It also says that you can use carrots, cauliflower, cabbage, or sliced green peppers. Today, I'll show you what I'm gonna do. So this is the mix. And like I said, it's got um, salt, mustard seed, celery seed, turmeric, red pepper, cayenne pepper, and spices. So I'm just going to use two tablespoons. I'm gonna mix it up with a little bit inside here. And I'm gonna use two tablespoons which is almost the container, but not quite. Because this is a little spicy, and some people may not be able to tolerate spices. Um, and then it says to use your apple cider vinegar, which actually it says white wine. I'm using apple cider vinegar. We know that it has great uh, helpful effects. It actually pre-digests some of the food for you because it is a vinegar. So we're gonna use one cup of this apple cider vinegar and then we're going to use some pomegranate juice. I'm going to do something a little differently today. This will add like a sweet and sour taste. So I'm going to use a quarter cup of that. Put that in your little mixer and then we'll use, uh, we'll just mix that up you might have to add, and I am going to add a cup of water. So I got some good water, and I'm going to add that. It's better, uh, low pH water, it will help with a little bit of the consistency. You want the better water that um, is not in the plastic that has all the um, major issues with leaching into the water. So, okay, so that made your little, brine or whatever you want to call it. So I cut up some cucumbers and these were just like little pickling cucumbers. I really quickly blanched some fresh green beans. Now you can get frozen green beans and do this. So those are blanched and that's put in there. Uh, I also have some celery uh, that was cut in small pieces. Um, this is one honey crisp apple. I decided to try that. And I cut up some carrots. These are fresh carrots. And then I also have some onions. And this is just a white medium onion. So it's about a half of an onion. And I got all that in there. And then I cut up uh, two, just two roasted red peppers. And we'll put those on. Now, all these foods actually have a wonderful quality for them. A lot of people don't like onions because they don't like the smell of an onion. They don't like how it maybe gives them indigestion or something. Uh, so this is about stomach juices and stomach acid and what you might be out of balance with. So we're going to try this. It's a milder version of, it's got some spicy stuff and spices are okay. Um, but you might have to, if you like spice, you might have to like back it down a little bit. If you don't like spice, uh, this might not be the recipe for you. There are dill pickle mixes that are wonderful that are fresh icebox dill pickle mixes. So then you just pour this over top and you let that sit. You might have to add a little bit more water or, um, you know, I would check on it within like six hours and see where it's at. And then you just mix that together. And this is um, like a little pickling 
You can put it in jars. Uh, it's a fresh pickling mix, and I hope you enjoy it and try it. There's all kinds of new ways to introduce flavors. You don't want to, you know, consume too much at one time and just taste and see how it is with your body. Diane Greco-Allen, Food Relationship Coach. I hope you're having a wonderful day. Thanks.